finally, we'll hit the soccer pitch where a team in Prince Albert is breaking down borders in the name of sport with players from all over the world, some of them refugees just finding a home in Canada. Jules Knox has the story. Wadi Alphonse started playing soccer as a little kid in the Congo. When he moved to Prince Albert as a refugee a couple of months ago, he signed up for a team right away. Mm, soccer in Canada is, is too funny and then I like it. Yeah. He plays for Carleton High School and many of his teammates come from other countries too. Coaches say at least seven different languages can be heard in the locker room, but Alphonse says language barriers don't matter when the team is out on the field. Yeah, we can speak the same because, because you, you can say that like, yeah, pass me, pass me, like, hey, hey, hey. Yeah, I can hear it and then I can pass to you. Patrick Mahumbre has been playing soccer in Prince Albert since he moved here as a refugee from Uganda almost five years ago. The best part is we don't argue to each other, like, because we don't speak seven languages, so we won't argue. It's, it's nice to see how they pick also some of the says from another language besides English. So, like, Sweri will be, uh, he's, uh, he speaks Sewahili, but he will try to say something in Spanish even when he's trying to learn uh, English. Players new to Canada say there is one downside to the game in our country. You know, snow, that's, that's different to me. But they also say their teammates are like family. Being in the locker room with them, it's like more fun than like being on the pitch. You're like Although we lose or win, we, we just forget about it when we're in the locker room. It's like just forget about it, move on. Yeah, it's like real fun. As for their goals... We're waiting for St. Mary's, so we'll take them on. The team is hoping to score at regionals and then move on to provincials in Regina at the end of the month. Jules Knox, CTV News, Prince Albert.